Hey Benjamin, this is Ryan with TrendLizard.com. Uh, the second stock that I decided to take a look at out of your current holdings was Finisar or FNSR trading on the NASDAQ. Really interesting stock, telecom stock trading on the NASDAQ again. Uh, it was incepted back pretty much at the height of the bull market back in 1999. Uh, it was a high flyer at that time. Uh, tanked, absolutely tanked into the 2002 low and has been on the recovery, uh, more notably off the 2009 low, to its current point right now. So <clears throat> the big decline it had off the 1999, I guess the ultimate high happened 2000, down into the 2009 low, looks like one big counter trend move. Uh, and since then, it's had a really nice base, didn't do much from 2011 into the 2015 low. Um, but it's formed a really nice base and looks like it's getting ready to really take off here. Not only does it have a really nice inverse head and shoulders, this being the head, uh, left shoulder here, right shoulder here. Uh, it has a beautiful Elliott wave pattern off that low as well. So this looks very promising. Um, it looks like a big trendy up leg completed in 2011. From there it has a nice three wave counter trend pullback into the 2015 low. And now it looks reinvigorated and ready to take off off the 2015 low. So let's zoom in on this move right here because this is really the one that's most applicable to us and its potential to continue up significantly higher from here. So if we zoom in, um, it's hard to get a really solid labeling on this move off the 2016 low. But what is clear is that it looks very incomplete, whatever it is. It does not look like a completed five wave move. So. Um, this is a pretty high flying stock obviously in 2016 it's moved from 12 to 33 in light of that it's pretty hard to get a super close stop level um, unless you just want to step aside for any near term pullbacks here if you're trying to stay in this move as long as this advance is, is continuing off the 2016 low the best level you can do for a stop at the current time is 23 um, that's a factor of how incomplete this up move looks um, so you kind of have to give it a wide berth to allow for another pullback similar to this to happen and then continue higher from there. So the stop level's loose. That's unfortunate, but it looks very bullish, absolutely. Uh, and the potential is there for this to continue significantly higher overall uh, on the long-term time frame off this 2009 low as a large five-wave advance advance take shape off that 2009 low. So, hey, I hope that's helpful. Happy holidays to you, and I'm sure we'll talk to you again soon. Take care.